guys, me your host Supersonal, thank you very much for tuning in, and today I want to show you how to make a really cool stasis chamber for your Weapon X Wolverine. This is probably going to be for the Marvel Legends of Wolverine, as it's the right scale, and all you need to create this, guys, is going to be one of these, a Treasure X Alien set. Now you need the Season 2 one because it comes with the big base bottom along with a nice gold top. You can spray paint these the bottom but the bottom top the top and bottom silver if you'd like to give it that more authentic comic book feel. But we're gonna need to empty the contents of this bad boy out first of all. So let's go ahead and do that. <clears throat> so these are perfect to use as the chamber because of this. So the alien itself is held in this pod which is attached to the roof, and you can salvage that. All we have to do is pull this off gently. Take out the alien. And there you have a nice capsule to fit the Wolverine. And because of the th how thick this is, you're going to be able to put Wolverine in like a hunched up position and everything. Of course we're going to need to take these stickers off as well. We need to get rid of all the all the diagrams and stuff that comes with this packaging. There is a little leaflet at the bottom to go with this little thing. If you want to see a review of this, by the way, we will be putting that on Instagram. Uh, me and my daughter will be doing that. And you're going to want to, want to watch out because I believe there is... Oh, it's not in there right now, but you can put the ooze in the top of there. But this is actually airtight as well, so you could even go ahead and put water in here as well, and it'd still look really cool. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> no, it's not. You can put your hands straight through the damn thing. So there's this little bottom part, which you can just pop in if you want to just create a little bit of a... like a bottom part. But that doesn't matter. Let's just move all this to one side. Because the real part of the show is this. So this is what we need to place Wolverine inside. Repop these together. Two at the bottom. Make sure you pop these together so it holds the Wolverine in place like this. And then simply reattach the plastic. either side like that and then place back into the chamber and there you have it boys and girls we have a Wolverine in stasis yeah best part is you could even put you could even put Sabretooth in there you could put X-23 in there any Marvel Legend would probably fit in there that's the beauty of this pack so it's good for multiple characters I'm going to go ahead and have a play around with the posing of this and I'll take some photos to pop over on Instagram as well. So I'll be back in just a few moments once I've got come like once I've got once I've got him set up the how the way I want him. So just give me a moment. So guys, here it is up close. I know people are going to ask me, so I thought I might as well just jump in and grab the video footage while I'm here. So this is what it looks like up close, guys. I like the fact that the um the actual plastic is like a liquid blue. So it does actually look like a specimen in like a you know in the in the blue liquid just like it should do from the from the comic pages it looks like he's floating in water there as well which is really nice you can very you can only just make out the plastic when you actually zoom out look you can't tell that plastic's even there and you know what would look even cooler if you had like a little led light you could put in the bottom here and shine it upwards through the tube it would make one hell of a glow like a like a glow light so the only thing I can think of that would be even better than this would be to get an actual lava lamp and shove Wolverine inside of it, basically. That's the only other thing I can think of. But this is like a, a very good, cheap alternative. Like I say, it's only 15 quid to buy the actual alien once you've taken that out of it and shoved Wolverine in it. It's a decent little display kit for the Avid you know, the Avid collect Collector and Customizer. I'd just say spray the top and you wouldn't even know the difference. It looks like it actually belongs in there, which I really like. What do you guys think? Let us know in the comments. So there we have him, guys. I've got him a bit more hunched up. I've got the legs kind of a bit more. So it looks like he's floating now within the tube as well. As you can see, he's not touching the bottom. 
like he was before. I've got him in a more hunched position so the helmet slightly touches the front here so it stops him from sliding down and it makes him look like he's completely frozen up in, in sort of mid sort of mid air so it looks like he's almost floating in the water. <laughs> he's so cool. Oh he's fallen. Hang on. Yep, there we go. Just plunk him back up. But if you have him on display he's not going to fall so it's just, it's just I'm moving him around. But yeah, a perfect display. If anyone's interested in doing the same, all you need to do is pick up one of these Treasure X packs. You can pick them up off Amazon uh, for, for about £10. Um, it's got a cool little hook on it if you had to hang it from somewhere and stuff. Um, again, it would be so easy to customise this even further by spray painting the gold bits uh, grey or black to give it that more authentic look. And it wouldn't take much to back this on the inside to give this like another colour as well so that Wolverine's actually like got a top and bottom to it it would be so easy to do so yeah for me this is the perfect stasis chamber for a Marvel Legends Wolverine and like I said you could even fit Sabretooth or anywhere in here so I hope this was some help for some of you guys out there that like to do things like this like me and like to have their figures on display <laughs> but yeah thank you very much guys for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, yeah thank you very much for watching I hope you hit subscribe hit like and I'll see you in the next video. May the force be with you.